So, hello and welcome back to another playthrough of your Brothers 4. We are playing with the Elder Scrolls Universalis mod again because I, our last playthrough with, of it just kind of stopped a little bit early and we didn't really get much to experience overall. So I thought I'm just gonna go back in and give it another spin. Now at first I did want to try someone else than the Night Hollow Clan. But, thanks to uh, uh, the mod maker Ethereum himself, the cavern bug that I had last playthrough is, has been fixed. So that's quite nice. Uh, <laughs> well, did, did react quite fast to that. So we're gonna jump in as the Night Hollow Clan again and try to do maybe do things better, just overall, I mean, now that we have roughly an idea of what's going on with them, maybe, this is getting a little bit more clear. And now that I still have to, con uh, like, still have the connections even after reloading, we will see what we can get out of this. There's also l some slight changes, one that is very important for me is uh, this one. Turning off licensed music for YouTube. That is something that ha actually I was another thing that I uh, that uh, w was a problem with the Elder Scrolls Universalis mod. We're also gonna turn off news from other countries. Uh, actually, no, I think we're gonna leave it in. There's also other mod options that you can turn off, like modular kingdom ranks, conquest events. Matching colors of with subjects and stuff like that, but we are gonna leave everything as it is. You could also disable regions. These changes are destructive and can be reversed. But yeah, there's a little bit more stuff uh, being done. But we are vampires. <coughs> Still the same thing, Lady Pelena Norsham. Quite a nice ruler, and she will of course stay with us forever. So we'll have her around with her impression on our skills. I'm wondering if th we now have something to actually improve her stats. I don't know. We'll see. We also technically would have full on uh, absolutism. And of course we can once again decide for a government reform. And this time I'm actually not gonna go for elective monarchy. Even though I think the, norm the normal uh, reform modifiers are definitely better than the autocratic monarchy. <coughs> But there is something else in the autocratic monarchy that I think is better than uh, the other, uh, than the elective monarchy, and that is the government interactions here, because those are really impressive. <laughs> they take longer to, I think, get, but overall, like just here, gaining 150 admin, gaining 150 diplo, or gaining 150 military military power. It's just good. It's just really good, isn't it? <laughs> of course, there's other benefits to it, but overall... We are gonna this time play with this a little bit. Either way... <coughs> we still have the same situation as last time. We have, uh, we have tributaries, and basically no one really likes us. There are potentials. Greyhost. And some other stuff. Kingslayers. Either way, we're gonna immediately try to improve relation with the grey host, wherever they were now. God damn it! I could have just clicked on it. There we go. Over there. I mean, they are aware of me, or I am aware of them. And they are the closest to getting this done. So I guess a royal marriage will be enough. I'm not sure if they get just get beaten up, but they are also seem seemingly part of the Molag ba Molag Bal cult. Therefore, immediately of interest to us. Seriously? <coughs> okay. Need to do need to improve relation a little bit more. Cool. We have a lot more merchants. I just realized, and a lot more diplomats, right? Or uh, whatever. We're making a lot of money from taxation, which is nice. We have. These merchants now, I mean, I guess we might as well. S this is... 
Hmm. We're already collecting from here. Just doesn't tell us, or maybe someone is on the way. Okay, then we just have to... We technically only can push from here. That's a little bit shit. I guess we'll also collect from here. Yeah, let's do that. Seems alright. Uh, we are also... Okay, this is all alright. We have the institutions set up to it. We... I'm not sure if there's any change here, but... Looting speed and movement speed. Quite nice. And we'll see what else we can unlock. Yeah. We still have the same mission tree. Still the massive uh, mission tree from the mod itself. But also, of course, the unique mission tree for the vampires. And I think there is... Not much change here. Nope. Oh, this one was not bad. I think there was something... There, like, there was one mission that actually wanted me to have a specific idea group. And once again, I'm not sure where it is. <laughs> uh, I guess it's not too important. It will come up when it come up, when it comes up. First, we do need an, uh, 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 we need a friend, and then we need to become more organized. Yeah, and we need a rival that we are at war with. Okay. That is all doable. We have this origin of inscription, which just gives us a lot of points. We have this uh, need to have a ridiculous amount of development, a ridiculous amount of points. All right, there's there's once again a lot going on, and we'll need to go for it. Uh, we don't need that. I don't think we need any of you. We once again have the vampire verification. We have you if we need it, and we have you if we need it. We're probably not, we're probably never gonna click the convert buttons. But this one might be interesting at some point. And this one might as well. <coughs> Alright. We of course have the issue of these guys not really being converted. They're non-accepted culture, so... We'll take a bit to get them over. Let's take a look at these guys. Once again, there's a lot of stuff here. But I don't think... Alright, oh this is this was the one, this was the mod where uh, there's also negative aspects to absolutism. So maybe we don't want to push absolutism all the way. Let's actually take a take a decent look here. So there's discipline goes down. No, no, no. Manpower recovery speed, but tax goes down. I mean, tax is currently our main income. But manpower recovery speed could be really useful. I think that we do, we do this one. Doesn't even cost... Oh, right, this costs me admin to activate. Alright. Then I think we're gonna ignore all of that, actually. <laughs> Until we have something. For example, like the missionary stuff might be useful. But I would like to have some more points available before we do this. Yeah. Council of Nobility is also quite useful. We do have slaves. Do we want to seize land just to see what we get out of it? I think I actually am gonna do that. Yeah, and let's also summon a diet right away. To get this done, this just looks like... <laughs> okay, the, the slaves want me to have an admin guy. I think we're gonna do this one here. Maybe we'll get, we'll get somewhere with that. There are our tributary states. Let's improve relations with them. I mean, we might as well just put two guys in charge to make them really happy. We are also gonna say you guys give me manpower. I have a feeling that this is more important. <coughs> And of course, we're gonna work towards picking them apart <laughs> once again when we have enough uh, uh, relations there. So, you guys. 
Let's do that. Ah, um, uh, no, we don't have that much. Let's do it like that. Get get up to force limit. Fairly important. We can also easily take advisors, right? I kind of want to let the game pass for a second, just to see how much money we actually uh, have after this. In the meantime, we can also take a quick look at potential targets again. So we have still the empire on on us on our ass and we own a bunch of stuff a bunch of the territory but i guess the same targets are still not part of the empire for example you guys are an, a decent enough target right away you guys are part of the empire or are you wait a second you're not So this might be actually a better uh, uh, strike before anyone else can take it. Okay, actually I think I'm gonna build a spy network over here then. So we can just jump into that. Yeah. So the game basically needs to do something. Uh, this is not a yes, guys. This is this is a still a no. Just to let... There we go. <laughs> Grey host. <laughs> Alright, mercenary companies. There's a lot of golden arrows that just happened. Can I have one as well? No. Right, I didn't even take a look here. Halven State. Discover Art Mortar. Uh, colonization of High Rock. 25 Temples. Professional Army. Pure pot Bloodline. Okay, also it seems like our merchant has just come back. Cool. Let's just send them here to collect. Okay, we get even more money. That is that is a full advisor, I think. That is full advisor, in my opinion. Why do we only have the K, guys? I guess we can actually get you in charge. So. And we also could have a friend. The Grey Host. Let's go. Having a few alliances, I think, doesn't hurt. Yeah, yeah, rivals as well. I think there's gonna be a lot more rivals anyway. Let's just pick the ones that are that rival us. There we go. The wandering trader policy. We are just gonna set to neutral. Yep. Of course, we are a little bit alone. Okay, now we actually have more targets. Can we actually pick alt fund? Yeah, we can. Just to make this a little bit more spicy for us. Yeah, but we are just a victim with our current position. There's not much people that like us. Can't say anything about that. We do need a general as well. This stuff is a little bit f too far away for that. Right? Yep. We also have factions. Let's take a look at those real quick. Because we have a missionary strength faction. This one is... Uh, I mean, we just have the clergy that... Basically, I mean, I guess the, the best that we want is the guilds usually in charge. If we try to convert something, we want to have uh, someone else in charge. And I think one is not enough. Yep. So I would actually... Oh, 50! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay. I guess we don't have that much influence over that. Uh, we actually have a full army, so let's do the first one. I, I, yeah, we'll, we'll see about if if this gets messy. The next thing that we need to do is conquer 25 provinces. We need to also have three allies. So I think we're just gonna... Alright, these guys are also my friend, yep. I just need one more. One single guy more. Kingslayer. They are new. They I didn't have them last time as a potential friend, so let's improve relations with you. Uh, do you guys also want a royal marriage? Sure. We need more soldiers. Uh, we don't need to have this active. We technically don't need any of these active. They're currently just a little bit stub, uh, a little bit bordering. Technically, we want twenty-five 
temples. But we also, I guess, need money from something else. Why are you... Purchase modern ideas. Wait a second. Request to purchase modern ideas. Is that an institution or what is that? It's not an institution. Then what the hell is that? Oh, our knowledge. I mean, how much... Sure. Don't even know who you are. I guess I'll take it. Uh, we're still doing that. This one costs a hundred, so this is also all more expensive. But we do need a general, right? Just waiting for that doesn't kick it. It usually doesn't. Oh, this, uh, but we do need one. And I'm not gonna give my ruler military command. Because I have the feeling that they just die. So you have two allies. That's not cool. You also have two allies. That's also not cool. And you're all already this guy's getting attacked. That's shit. That's just shit. These two are part of it. Hmm. You're one of my vassals and you're one of my vassals. The Red Horde clan also has a bunch of allies. Okay, this is this is um, an immediate a uh, little bit of a problem. None of you are allied to these guys, right? Asha Vassal? Who the hell is that? I mean, you yourself are not a problem. Oh, you're right here. You're actually a problem. And I don't bother you. And these guys? They're a little bit further away, so we don't need to be worried about them in this kind of conflict. I still would see them as my main targets. Oh, I guess the King Slayer's a little bit further down. What about you? You're closer. Improve relation. Oh, we also, of course, have the cult of Molag Baal. I didn't even say, talk about that. <coughs> upkeep and leaders without upkeep and mercenary manpower. So we're probably going to go for a little bit of mercenary. There's also the church powers, which do, do take quite a while to get in. So we are not going to have to focus on that. We could call to convert some stuff. But we'll see about that soon enough. I assume that everybody would join them. I mean, there's obviously nothing speaking against that. So let's first of all create a claim right away. Let's stop that then. Same thing over here. Always going for opportunistic fights. So then over here. For this one we would need to see some provinces. To actually get a better connection. So I guess nothing immediate. I'm not sure if they are gonna... I mean they are up to six. Like you had the same allies. Hmm. There we go. There is our third ally. Don't need to really push on that. I just want them. Here we go. Wait. Third. That's not a problem, right? We can only have two. Oh, because of our... Wait. Birth sign. Right, that was also a thing. Ugh. Okay, I mean, yeah, sure. Why not? I mean, infantry cost goes down and mercenary cost go. I, f I feel like I could fight these guys then, actually. But we got this form alliances, which does a hostile cooperation cost on us. Then we need a port. And 50 marketplaces. Okay, that's gonna take a second. So no immediate thing. With these guys, I mean with our stuff here, like I said, there is nothing really that we can do at the moment. Legitimacy is going back up. We need a hundred rust and an air. 
does this happen with you guys? I mean, I guess I could introduce new air just to get one. So you guys have six. Obviously, I don't think anyone is that willing to help me. Distant war, this, and then these guys are just getting worse. <coughs> I also assume that nobody's willing to become my uh, to become my uh, vessel, uh, my tributary, right? I mean, we might as well take a look. Okay, there's no one r even close. <laughs> I mean, wall time has 200 re negative reasons. Do I actually just throw these guys away then? I mean, I guess there's no need for us to drop so ma so many points. And the grey host is really far away. Yeah, let's get rid of the grey host. Fuck, we have, an we have a marriage with them. Forget it. That was, that was specifically the wrong guy to drop. Nah, is, I guess we're just gonna... Get, I'm quite happy that you guys have that much stuff here, so that's alright. We have also some rebels to deal with. After all, we have the stop problem with the religion and everything else. Maybe we do culture convert just to get things in order already. I mean, there are some minor places. Like, there is 26. Doesn't seem too troublesome. Base value, the Eliasiadas, culture adjacent to Kartalt. Of course, that will piss off people, but who cares. And I guess we're always gonna wait for this culture adjacent modifier. Oh, some of them even already have that. And are still quite expensive. I mean, we always have that option as well, the option right here, the Vampire Purification. But this one will always cost us a hundred, Diplo. So, I'm also not gonna accept these guys, screw that. <laughs> Do I look like someone who accepts, accepts other cultures? I don't know. Alright, but you are already in the right position, so... You can deal with that. Oh! I'll take the Diplo points back right away. Don't mind that. Okay, of course, now taking away stuff is a little bit problematic. Didn't we have like a ridiculous missionary strength from something? I recall having that. I'm not, but I'm not sure for what we did for that. Yeah, I guess before we do any war... We're just gonna... Deal with that stuff. Okay, you you did probably have this alliance and then you dropped it. I assume. Oh, we can take this ahead of time. Lovely. Check that innovativeness right away. <coughs> Are these guys happy enough to not cause a problem? Does this go any further than that? Oh, we, we do have some uh, stuff going on. You guys are also big enough for points. We can, like, we can do so much with you guys, it's ridiculous. Uh, that is Shade Feather Clan. Okay, so most of these are gonna be too much. Oh no, actually, there's something that we could take. Sure. I feel like I'm gonna. The, uh, this seems to be the right choice. God damn it! All of your allies help you out. I assume. I don't think that the work declaration now makes sense. So you are fighting East March and Lotta Bar. You have twenty k. Wow. Okay. Uh, you guys, Black Drake Clan. That was you. Let's see if we can find something again. I mean, I just like weakening my vessels. <laughs> uh, my uh, tributaries here. If I have the option to uh, like to weaken them that way, I'll take it. No worries, I'll take it. <laughs> we never. We can even do. Uh, we do. Uh, uh, fuck. We even have vampire orders. Oh, what do you know? A blessed man. We get legitimacy and a half cost guy. And you know what? Actually, let's, fin let's finish that up again. This one costs us church power. I think we don't need money, right? I would rather take the church power. 
We could also, I, gu I guess... As long as we have the royal marriage, it doesn't make a difference. If that is active or not. But that basically currently means that maybe... You guys will fall off here. So we have Black Drake Separatists. Yep, they actually come up. But it's gonna take a hot second. The caverns are cool, but they are deep. So... Okay, sure. <laughs> that thing. I just come all right. Uh, no, whatever. <laughs> just take your time. Just take your time. Now I feel like this money I'm gonna keep for now. Oh, and there's the t the pale attacking. All right, let's quickly get this siege done, and then we're gonna start the war against you guys. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're gonna be there soon enough. Steam crack is also over there, so it seems like most of our rebellions t happen over here. Good to know. Let's quickly solve this issue. Merchant caravan. Uh, I guess we just. I mean, I guess we give them a sack of gold. Let's see what they do with it. Maybe they do some cool stuff. How we're looking here. Okay, you guys seem to be fairly happy about all of this. Oh, well, I mean not happy, but... Not super angry. Alright, but this is clearly a point where I jump in. So, you guys don't join and you guys I don't care about. You have 6k troops. Let's quickly get a mercenary group involved. Bloodhawkers. They cost me 23 ducats. Wow. That's hilariously cheap. But yeah, sure. It of course gets us quite heavily over limit, but I'll take it. We're also going to take an artillery here. Now, of course, this is going to be unpleasant. Oh, lovely. See, that's what I meant. These guys are probably not going to be limited. Oh, wow, you guys did that rather fast. And these guys join now, but to be honest, with what they have left, I don't care. So. Do we even... Well, you don't have anything left. Alright, mercenary group. If you have the option, go here. I guess for now you're gonna run here. Let's see about your troops first. Wherever they are. Oh, there they are. Let's get you guys before we can get friends. I guess there is a lot of kind of stuff that I don't care about or don't know re re even what it does. So maybe I just don't care about it. Maybe I just don't care about it. Ah, uh, protect. Uh, I don't want to spend money and I guess... It's a shame that we don't gain anything out of it with this, but I guess what can we do? I would just let allow that to happen. Okay, so for a second I thought the, the pale also attack these guys. But I guess this one is rather fast. Can get this done. Uh, technically you guys don't need uh, help, so I don't think I'm gonna help you. You guys just come together, you guys do that, 
Ouch. That hurt. You're retreating somewhere else? I think I want to get these sieges done here first. There's two places occupied, but to be honest, who cares? So. Do we just let the mercenary siege? Uh... I mean, you guys did get some numbers together, I'm not gonna lie. But now you're going for a siege, and I don't like that at all. There we go, add to the throne. Now we just need to get a trust. Or do we? Oh no, one of the following must be true. Okay, then we just take that. Improve relation, prestige. Why not? To allies. Oh yeah, that lasts a hundred years. Cost our cooperation cost on us. That kind of discourages our AI neighbors to attack us. But I guess we're also gonna end the episode here anyway. So like always, like, subscribe, motion, on again. I guess see you guys next episode. Bye!